Which contact group is doing the washing up today? Development management is um, a class about creating projects and thinking about the projects that deal with social change. Uh, the students uh, learn to develop something called LFA, which is logical framework approach to projects in this class. And that is very special for IPC that we actually teach this uh, management tool. A lot of people, they are already working in the NGOs in a developing country and they come here to specifically get that tool so they can go back and write applications and make good and uh, comprehensive uh, projects. Right. So what they do in groups is that they get together and they uh, start um, an NGO. So they pick a problem that concerns them personally or that uh, exists in their region and then they develop um, a structure that could be translated into a bunch of different projects where they formulate an uh, aim and objectives and activities and outputs as to how to implement a change to solve some kind of problem in their area. But they also always have to have a resource person. Let's say you want to do changes in a slum area in Kenya. There has to be someone in a Kenyan, basically, in the group who knows about the problems that they want to solve. Or if you want to do something about uh, the environment in Budapest, you have to have someone from Budapest in the group that knows specifically about the problems. And then they design, the, uh, step by step, they design the, uh, these projects. And it's a very satisfying, it's a long and complicated process, but it's also a very satisfying process where you actually, at the end of the class, you have a real product that you could eventually take with you back home. And this is basically one group that turned uh, problems into objectives with a very, very comprehensive analysis because it's basically an analysis of uh, why the Japanese society is so dependent on nuclear uh, energy and that group consisting of uh, Japanese they really wanted to analyze how come that our society is so dependent and how can we change that and so this is just one step in that uh, process. And this is what you learn in this class, uh, the ethics of giving, because when you take something from somebody, it comes with a consequence, and whoever asks for support should understand that, and that's what you also will get out of this class.